Hey guys, on the menu today is my lasagna roll-ups. So let's head on to the kitchen and let's get started. Anytime you cook in Italian, you really want some good ingredients, okay? Uh, like, I, like I say, the garlic, you want some fresh garlic, okay? As well as your fresh vegetables, okay? So what we're going to do next, right here, I do have my... Uh, pasta pan and I already have water in it I'm going to add salt okay because you want to season your pasta okay and then our next step I'm going to take the casings off of these Italian sausages we're going to go here to our skillet and we're going to start the cooking process okay guys I did add a little bit of oil already in my skillet now we're going to start with our ground beef. Try to get it all in there. Okay, and then our sausages. We're going to take the casings off. Okay, we're just going to break them up and mix them in together. Okay, that went pretty well, y'all. That was pretty quick. Okay, now we do want our um, onion and bell pepper to cook in with it. And also our garlic. Because we want the best meat mixture as possible, okay? So let's add in our onion. Our bell peppers. Also, our garlic. Okay, so we're going to mix that well. Okay, we're going to mix it in really good, really, really good. Okay, and when I come back, we're going to go to the next step. Okay, guys, as you can see, I hardly have any liquid in the bottom of my pan, which is great. Okay, so we're going to go on and add in all our seasonings. Okay, we're going to work in that, that uh, pasta sauce and put it all in there. And we're going to add a little bit of water just to add, uh, get the rest of that sauce out of there. Okay, so we're going to add in our diced tomatoes. Okay, once we get everything uh, stirred in, we're going to go on and taste and see where we are. And that way, if we need to adjust, we can do so now. Okay, so let me get a spoon. Okay, and I'm going to go right in the middle here. And I want to taste that meat sauce. Y'all, 
I don't need anything. You know what? Just a little. You know what? A little bit of sugar. Hold on. Okay, so let's add a little bit of sugar to cut through that the acid in there. Cause I can I have an aftertaste. Let me see if that worked. But other than that, everything else is great. Let me get another spoon, y'all. Let me wash it off. Okay, so let's go back in here and taste again. Yeah, now that's perfect. Yes. Okay. So now what we're going to do, we're going to turn it down low, about medium low, well low to a simmer. And we're going to put the lid on this, okay, and let it simmer for about 30 minutes, okay. Over here, y'all, I do have my pasta going. It's going, it should be ready in a few minutes, and then we're going to put it all together. Okay, guys, I'm getting ready to uh, put my roll-ups together. Okay, my ricotta, I do not use egg, okay? I'm very specific when it comes to the egg. Egg, to me, is for bacon. Okay, so I'm adding a little bit of ricotta with salt and pepper. We're just going to season it up. Okay, and a little bit of salt. And that's how we that's how we gonna fix our rock Okay. Okay, so let's get ready to assemble. Okay, guys, I hope the, Lord ne the noise is not too loud. I have my yard people here. I'm trying to get my pasta. Okay, so I'm going to lay two down first. Okay, maybe I can do three. I can do three at a time. Or three at once. Let's just do that. Okay. In the bottom of my pan, I'm gonna put some meat mixture. Okay. And on each one of these, y'all, this really made a lot. Okay, and then we're gonna put a avocado. That's why I said y'all don't like egg because I don't be knowing if that egg gonna cook in there or not. And this is how it's gonna go, y'all. Okay, and then we just gonna roll them up. Try and get it rolled up. Come on, girl, work with me. Let's just do that. Okay, and then I'm gonna put it in my pan. Where is my spatula? Here we go.
And we're just going to put it in our pan, y'all, just like that. And let me work on the rest of them. Okay. One down and a few more to go. When I come back, we go to the next step. Okay, guys, we are finished stuffing. So we're going to add our mozzarella cheese right over the top. And this is shredded, and it is finely shredded too. Okay, make sure you cover them all well. Okay, and then we're gonna add some Italian right over the top. Okay, and then we're gonna put some parsley right over the top of that. So when it bakes, we see that pretty color in there, okay? In the oven, 350 degrees for about 35 to 40 minutes. When you see it ooey gooey and cheesy, then you know it's ready to take out. Okay, and when we come back, we're going to have our uh, lasagna roll-ups. <laughs> 